Hello everyone, I'm Lost Griff, and this is your Daily Dose of Brawlhalla. So Sandstorm has been non-stop dominating recently. Today's highlights show his run in the Autumn Championship where he used Mirage and Tezka. Do you guys think Sandstorm will take BCX? Let us know down below. And Light Sayer, it's not going to yeah. give you the same amount of oh. Oh man, Sandstorm just holding this corner here made things feel like even, but now, I mean, Sandstorm's been pretty much uncontested for like, Jesus Ooh. freaking Christ, like, has a spear lined up, so now it's just D-Lights here or recovery, and he tries to go for the recovery. I do like that mix-up off the side light. It covers a lot of dodge options, but the side air is going to be the one. Ooh, that jump was immaculate, just narrowly avoiding getting his toes clipped off there, and now Sandstorm, oh. ooh, no dodge from Pugsy off of that side light. I thought Pugsy is not spot dodging them or punishing him, and look at this juggle situation he got as a result of it, but it might be a little too late here as Pugsy goes oh! for the final edge guard and this is the immediate downer off stage that unarmed downer is going to find it as well and Pugsy more than that to come out on top all right has Pugsy out in the open air oh, no. oh he's sweat beating yeah. down light side air sandstorm gonna get that first stock three but Pugsy answers back this is extremely close oh man <laughs> the dash landings from sandstorm starting to trip up Pugsy a little bit he's like which side are you coming on and Sandstorm gets KO'd by like a side sig now, but nothing else really. So as long as he avoids getting hit, like that D6's not gonna KO. It launches. And now it's scary because he's in D-Light recovery range. Oh! Nice. Not quite enough. One more Jumping hit, dodge. yeah. Nice. So heartbreaking, but with that said, in this game, game number four now, Sandstorm one game away from closing out this set and potentially getting the other uh, revenge for Dallas. But on the other side of things, Pugsy looking to repeat history, but struggling a little bit here as Sandstorm almost gets the edge guard. They are really playing this offstage game right now. Who will come Ooh. out on top? Playing a little bit neutral here. Sandstorm opening up Pugsy. Running out of chances here for Pugsy. Needs to get on stage. I like the patience. He's like, I'm not going out there, bro. Don't need to. Bro, that D-Light call the game right there and the set. They are. They will, they'll enjoy the cardboard box that is a flat map over <laughs> the nice, pristine triple platform map. Ooh. Double down light, side air, Sandstorm. Early lead, this is looking bad. But he's been able to slice has not looked nearly as a, as good. So hopefully, oh. uh, hopefully. What even just happened here? All right. Make sure you touch that wall. I don't think oh. he did. Oh, okay. chase style drop. He's good. Sandstorm. All right. All right. Final stocks here. Opportunity. I needed that at this exact moment. Can I just push it the full distance and the answer is no because sandstorm is just too relentless with the aggression he looked too silly to be <laughs> wilding on you like that but hopefully this change is what does it i mean i've always been an extreme fan of oh, oh man not like this yeah, don't like, start bro, it off he, like this he literally made me stop my sentence bro oh uh, he still touches and he didn't get the edge guard no he is adding up the damage not sure if he's in side air territory neutral lights oh. not gonna ko but a recovery from sandstorm Snowy's got to be careful, oh GC God, down so light. Big. Snowy's done for Sandstorm with a 3-0. Yeah, his scythe defense has really been the answer for sure. He's not allowing Sandstorm to get those strings like he's been getting against other players. He gets a side light. He's not going to go down there and commit. It's the threat of that recovery, right? Like, he doesn't, oh. it's too pinpoint. But the down sig, talk so about good. pinpoint accuracy. A little bit of, uh, uh, of nerf to the end lag on that for his whole lot. Wait a second, laddering up with the scythe. Okay past the wall, hoping that it would clip, clip Sandstorm, but instead he gets caught and caught again by that neutral signature. Sandstorm brings it back to an even score line on the set for Sandstorm SDing in remarkably, uh, remarkable fashion there. Oh, and Java now doing so much damage, taking more than a stock lead at this point with that side light connecting and Sandstorm switches back over to the side, but Java on the spear is so hard to fight against in a deficit like this. Neutral light recovery. Edge guard opportunity goes for the dare. No, weapon throws at the same time, and they both lose their weapon as a result of the knockback. Although Sandstorm's not letting him hit him. And Java's like taking a moment here, like, what do I do? How do I get in? Is falling Sare? Okay, rising Sare. Nah, because the commentator Loki just roasted Sandstorm. Yeah, and that, that's like when you know a spear player is pretty desperate, where they're like, okay, I'm using spear ground pound at center stage. Things must be bad, even if it does end up going to game five. That won't work again. As we just see, <laughs> Sandstorm. Uh, I mean, it led into a really great combo, though. So really, was it that bad? That strong hits is a little weaker than downlight, and Sandstorm like at, gets that side light um, and now between these two players. And now it's Java versus Sandstorm. Winner of this goes to the Autumn Royale, guaranteed. Because a nice job uh, jumping back with the Sair onto the stage. Sandstorm rubber sends him to the left side, waiting for that landing there. Gets the side light. No delight afterwards. The end light recovery will put Java off the side of the stage, but that recovery being gone. Will he look for it again here? He might look for it after a side light. 
Oh, but the neutral light recovery might stop Jabba from even having that as an option. And the down stick just barely doesn't knock out Sandstorm. A little miscalculation there. Daylight recovery will take him off the top, and now Sandstorm's on winner's bracket stock. Insult to injury there. Weapon throw down. Picks it up. He tries to go for another one. He goes for the dive kick, and now Jabba's an unarmed mode. Never mind. Okay. Stopped. Insane ending for a 2-2 two two close set. Oh, Sandstorm puts him off the side of the stage with that down air. Recovery hits. Ooh, okay. Sandstorm looking good. Java was looking Ooh. like he was in form to close this out without Sandstorm being able to fight Ooh. back. But right now. Up and throw. Yeah. Oh, this is getting close. Oh, Stuff no. recovery. That's huge. Oh, and this is close. Do you let recovery would knock out? Sarah gets him. Sandstorm low on a jump. He has to dodge, but he gets oh. the nair instead. The reversal's huge, but he doesn't trust his edge guard. So he goes back to the stage. Get back to center. Side light disarms him. Oh, the, the ground pound. The throw. Helicopter oh. him. Oh, he goes for the neutral stick. Do let recovery. Oh. Doesn't knock out. Java needs one more of those to work in the oh, recovery. My hits. He's he barely surviving. That lob is perfect. Yes. Oh my gosh. Wow is right, Mr. Announcer. He's hoping the boots are the answer. Maybe taking a page out of Kaina's book, right? Kaina struggled a lot against boosts at the Summer Royale. And maybe Sandstrom's like, hey, maybe Taros is just bad against Tezka. That is at least the same as his Mordek, right? Yeah. And this is a scenario oh, where this is exactly Luna. what you want. He got absolutely destroyed by Sandstorm. Battle boots just. Yeah, Sandstorm's really like the only one who's been playing boots in like top level competitive Brawlhalla for North America, right? Like, EU's got S Grape, uh, yes. SA has Wes, and NA oh, sometimes geez. has Sandstorm, but Sandstorm with the recovery. Sandstorm, I mean, kind of making big use of that to really get unanswered hits here. Like, Luna is getting stuffed. Quickest ground pound you'll ever see from Sandstorm there as a punish. Doesn't lead to the stock though, but he's just winning again and again and again. He's oh. making Luna look foolish. Oh, once again, Luna's second stock basically non existent. Bro just went on a vacation with battle boots. I love that Sandstorm does that jump, gravity cancel side light to get back onto the stage, land it. Oh my god. Oh he's my just, god. He's, gone. he's just gone. Sandstorm just completely, I mean, remix said it. Obliteration! <laughs> well, right now, Luna, hoping that the Mordex is in fact the answer, gonna try to utilize that scythe. Of course, he's got those gauntlets that he was playing on the Caspian. I'm wondering what this Mordex has to say here, because at least to start, Sandstorm looks like he's in the exact same spot he was last. We saw him getting several unanswered strings and, you know, getting very comfortable going for reads on Luna now. Luna, though, getting a few hits here and there, oh, but not nearly bounce. as much. Oh, oh, that's a sweat beat. Touch. Oh, he's gone, man. What are the gauntlets now? Neutral light. Yeah, man. Ah, oh, I didn't expect it to look this bad, but oh! Luna gets an answer there. Let's yeah. Go. What a wake up. I'm hoping this is enough. Luna with the Mordex against Sandstorm. I mean, to do this in game three in Winners Finals would be something Ooh. to say, but Sandstorm is getting that's a little swifty on him, he's and he's so back swifty. at it again, and he loves to go for these Nair follow-ups. He doesn't go to the immediate side air, but oh. this time he does, because he's like, you've taken so much damage, it was almost enough to KO. Sandstorm looking for one more conversion here. Might be a side light recovery, D light recovery. How does Luna need the perfect stock to stay relevant? Neutral Sig will bounce him off the stage. Sandstorm. Since then, maybe if he did one or two things, but mainly buffed is what my memory says. And so, oh. I mean, look at this, right? Like, recovery? No, goes for the nair. It's hard to be recovery. ready for a Volkov. That's a stock. Yeah, we trade those. <laughs> we don't fine. care. Yeah, this is what I wanted to see for Luna. Definitely whip this boy out. And I'm just remembering that one stock Sandstorm got in the last set. And I'm like, yeah, you get to win this. But it looks go. like the answer is no here is Luna just managed to get that side sit. Aggress here. Man, just to punish it this it. time, yeah. yeah, it was a little bit faster. And you have to be that on top oh. of things because it is so low end lag. Oh, nice. Oh, Off the weapon? Oh, what? Interesting. Okay. Yeah, not really sure what he was cooking there, but definitely something. Sandstorm, though, managed to get advantage, tries to get the D light, dashes back, and gets the end light as well. Wow. Light. That was down light there, down light recovery, and Sandstorm is putting this one away. Down light recovery. 1 1. Oh, yeah, Sansa has to go real okay. low there. Oh, missed the ground. Maybe a turnaround. Uh -oh. He got the dodge on that, too, oh. so he gets two. And that's just the stock. Yeah, catching Luna right after he dodges. Here's a retaliation Ooh. attack. Nice side sig off the got. pad as well. Goes for the down sig read. Might still have the stock here. Woo! That's it. Luna gets the reversal on Sandstorm. Reads high with the weapon toss. Can't punish the whiffed recovery. Ooh, Sandstorm throwing out recoveries. Luna throwing out his own. They both want that heavy hit. Sandstorm with a boots neutral light. Takes game number three, two, one. Sandstorm's one away from putting this one in the bag. Oh. Sandstorm cooked with this boots combo. That corner. 
a landing, Sarah. Oh, dude, oh, dude, oh. Dude, that was freaking godlike. And that was off a of reaction to that dodge oh. as well. Sandstorm just gets another perfect boots clip. All right. Oh. oh. He was trying to ride that one into the sunset, and Sandstorm sends him there himself yeah. with that side air weapon toss. Outspaced. Good dodge. Oh. Luna. Oh, doesn't hit the side air, though. He gets the Steals weapon, Steals the weapon. That was a dodge down. Luna not able to cover. Oh, no. That's oh. a punish. Oh, he's too high in the sky. The bat can fly. Side stick thrown out. Down light, Sare. It's not enough. Does he get a reversal nair here? Oh. oh. I thought it was a down stick for a second, but then I realized he was on boots. Oh, he's trying so hard. He side stick whiffed. Five. Sands on the oh! react and he brings him around back to the alley and throws him on the floor into the trash cans and says, get out the way. All right, and that's it for today's DDOB. Hope you guys enjoyed. And if you guys want more content like this, make sure you drop a like, comment, and subscribe. Take care.